Okay, so now I'm going to show you how to convert video files to an AMV format so that you can pl play them on the Craig MP3 player. Uh, first off, you're going to need a, an AMV converter, which uh, is the file type, and you can find several of these. Just Google for AMV converter, and Soft29 has a page of them, and we're going to be using the one at the bottom of the list. Uh, this one, this is provided with the MP3 player when you buy it on a CD. So you're going to download that and install that. And uh, you should be able to find it in your program files, uh, probably under MP3 player utilities. At least that's what it was on mine. But anyway, moving on. So once you start that program, it's a pretty simple program to use. You've got the output file, or input file, which is where you go through and select the file you want, and it gives you a list of uh, types that you can use, and I'm just going to use an intro that I recently made. It's got an output file uh, where you're going to put this, and I'm just going to store this on my desktop. It's got the start time, end time, uh, R time, T time, I'm not sure what those are. Anyway, but then you can go ahead and select the video and play it, and here it is on the little screen here. And you see it's uh, an e pretty simple intro. It's got sparks falling and the glowing logo and stuff. But that took forever to render because of the lights. But anyway, that's not about After Effects. Um, once the video has stopped, you can go into this uh, gear here. If you click on that, it will bring up a set settings box. And in here, you can change the screen width and height. Um, I think mine is a... 128 by 128, so we can select that. If you would like your video, um, so that you hold it at on the side on its side in order to view the video, you can go under Video Convert and change it. You can make it upside down. You can make it left or clockwise right, clockwise left, uh, so on and so forth. And then it's got the audio settings and stuff. And there's also a skin. You can change that if you want. But there's only two options, so it's not really that big a deal. But once you pick what you want, uh, select the song, and just hit this button here, which is to begin. And here's your progress progress bar. And it's even got this nifty little camera icon of the, the actual uh, file itself. It's uh, cute, isn't it? And it's also set up to uh, play the video upon completion of the conversion. And there we go. And as you can see, it made it very small because it is a very small s size screen. The Craig screen is only like a 1.5 inch screen, which is ridiculous because the model I have, it's got a lot more room. It could easily be a 1.8 inch, more like an iPod. But, you know, what do you expect for $25? Anyway. Like I said, I rarely play video on there. But once it's done, just go ahead and close that. And then just go into your file. Or not music. Go under the movies folder and just drag and drop it onto there. And that is all there is to that. Okay, so now on to the rest of this tutorial on how to use a Craig MP3 player.